Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to the Snack Pack. I'm Greg, this is Q. Together we're Mr. Happy 0121. Today, we're reviewing Cheetos Sweetos. And that's pretty much all I know about them. I was walking through the aisle today and saw them. From the packaging, it says limited time, so I've learned something else. Seven of them are a serving, and there are 160 calories for seven of them. No, I did it again. 25 of them are a serving. There are seven servings per container. I will learn to read that better in the future. So, 25 of these is 160 calories. I'm not very well versed in the uh, calorie department, so is that a good thing? Yeah. yeah. We'll see how big they are. 25 okay. of them are this big. Cinnamon sugar puffs. And he's got little rabbit ears on. I guess this is cinnamon is now something for Easter? It is now. Smells just like those um, Taco Bell cinnamon things. You know who uh, Chester Cheetah reminds me of? Who? Snoop Dogg. This is, this is, yeah, there's a little bit of resemblance. He I'm does not, now. I'm not, yeah, now. Does that mean that they've morphed Chester Cheetah to Snoop Dogg, or Snoop Dogg over time has morphed into Chester Cheetah? Number two. <laughs> Snoop Dogg should be the uh, spokesperson for Cheetos. I don't know what shape they're going for here. I guess Easter eggs. See the stripes? I had to look at the packaging to figure out the Easter eggs. What do you think? Man. They're not that good. They're salty and sweet. And, like the first time I tried it, it reminded me of like when you're at the dentist or, and you're getting your mouth clean. It kind of tastes like the... Uh, the strawberry filling they give you, it's like, it's salty and, yeah, it's, no, it, I, it's a C. C? C. This is old school. I'm surprised. You and I are going to go way different. We are. A minus, I liked it. I did not expect to like this. I don't like the twist from Taco Bell. I like the texture of these better. I like the crunch of these better. And I like the fact that when you first try it, it takes your mouth mid to the side if it's salty or sweet. It does. I like everything about it. A minus. Now, you say, how can you like everything about it and it be an A-? minus? Well, yeah. I don't like cinnamon. So for me to give this an A- minus is really a pretty major accomplishment. You don't like cinnamon? That's strange. Um, no, I don't like it. The only thing I can think of I like cinnamon, I think Apple Jacks are supposed to be cinnamon. So you don't like cinnamon rolls? No, not really. I'd rather have orange rolls. Yeah. You ever had orange rolls? Never. He has. I've made them for him. I, I have? Hurts my heart. I make the guy orange rolls he doesn't remember. How long ago was this? Years. Decades. I don't even remember what I like, had for breakfast this morning. 1963. So. I made oh, you some fresh orange. Yeah. Uh, Pillsbury makes them. They're, they're right next to them. Uh, same glaze except the roll is orange. And I much prefer it to a cinnamon roll. Yeah. Yeah. I know the Cinnabon people don't want to hear that. Screw them. Screw Cinnabon. I guess we won't be getting any uh, any freebies from them anytime soon. That's all right. That's all right. We'll still review their product, and unlike some reviewers who receive money under the table to review products, not saying any names at all. Not saying any names, just for you. Or initials. Not saying anything. He's not we're, saying anything. We're just not the reviewers that take money to give you guys reviews. Yep. That's it. Moving on. By the way, sometimes people say, I didn't hear the review. Just to be clear, I give them an A minus. This dude, a C. So we'll be folding this up and putting it on my side of the table. Can't have any. We are on the fourth week of the contest. That We've is done correct. It. Well, not the fourth week, the eighth week. I said. If we didn't have any winners by the 5th, we were going to guarantee a winner. But you know what? I jumped the gun. Today, I'm guaranteeing a winner. All right. Uh, previous entrants were Eric Weirath. Now, I'm sorry, Eric. I'm sure I got your name wrong again. Into the cup. Polo Ralph. Gabora 16. And then we added a new name today because, you know, we still draw the new name. Zachary Mann. Uh, 36 hours ago commented on our Mountain Dew Gummy, the original video. It surprises me that we don't have more names drawn out of that because people are commenting the hell out of that video. 
And as I shake the giant tumbler with many names in it, uh, this weekend, two great videos coming your way. Anniversary video, we give you the breakdown on how we started making videos, how we know each other, and why we're still making videos. That's right. You know, I get at least 10 messages a day saying from people saying, why are you still making videos? So we'll answer that. All righty then. Saturday, by request, we're going to do something, uh, once again, another little bit different video. Voltage Duitos versus oh. Whiteout Duitos. I'm excited for this one. When we made the Duitos videos over the weekend, I heard a lot of, you left out Whiteout, you left out Voltage. And no, we're not, we're not going to follow that up with the uh, live wire Duitos. I guess never say never. If enough people ask, we'll do anything. All right. You will reach into the cup, pull out one piece of paper. Oh, before you do that, we're playing for 20 bucks. It's $20. You win 20 big dollars. It helps when you tell people what they're winning. Go ahead. All right. What did we get? Eric, we're it. Yes. <laughs> Why did I have to pick that one? Why did you have to say the name? Oh. <laughs> oh. Alright, enough talk. I've stretched this out long enough. Reach in here and pull out a winner. 20 big dollars coming right to you. Just for you. Gabora 16. Second, uh, the second entrant. Gabora16, just hit us up, give us an instant message or a private message, give us your address, and boom, $20. We may even go old school and throw in a wrestling card from the 80s in there just for fun. That's right. Because, you know, it's just for you, my friend. Just for you. <laughs> All right. If we don't hear back from Gabora within two weeks, uh, we're going to do something else. Maybe we'll throw another entry in and draw again, but I want to give away this money. So, Gabora16, get in touch. We will get you, we're not even going to send you a check or a money order. We're going to send you cash. As Randy Moss used to say, straight cash, homie, 20 bucks. Who's Randy Moss? That's what a lot of people say now. But he was a guy that once said, straight cash, homie. Really? Yeah. I thought Abraham Lincoln said that. No. no. Um, you should, like, YouTube it. He was a football player that ran over a meter maid's foot and uh, <laughs> on purpose. And he was getting out of the courthouse uh, to go in and uh, pay his fine, and TMZ was out there, and they stuck a microphone in his face, and they asked him uh, how he expected to pay off his fine, and he said, straight cash, homie! I don't know, it stuck with me. Very yeah, I guess it did. One of these days, I want that on my uh, tombstone. Straight cash, homie? Yeah, I don't even want my name. Straight cash, homie! All right, that seems good enough. Boy, we just kept rolling with this. I don't know how much of this we'll keep. Sometimes, you know, as we're talking, we'll look at each other and go, that, that's not going to make it. And then other times, I watched a video the other day where we said that and it stayed in. Yeah. So, eh, we'll see. It'll be interesting to see what stays in this video. Tomorrow, tomorrow is Saturday. Yeah. Tomorrow we're doing the do we thing. Uh, coming up next week, I think we're going to get in on that, uh, the fish craze that's going to go around. We're going to probably do a couple three fish sandwiches for the our Catholic fans out there. Yeah, yeah. We'll get into why suddenly this time of year people are pushing fish sandwiches. You know, it's something that I didn't pay attention to for years, but there is a legit answer for that, and it involves our good friends, the Catholics. Thanks for watching, guys. We will see you tomorrow when we do disgusting things with Mountain Dew. Yeah. Yeah. There's a ladybug on my foot. That's gross, buddy. Yeah. It's has been chilling there for like a couple